Hello guys, in today's video, I'm going to be showing you how to get mods in Gorilla Tag. So the first thing what you want to do, I'll put a link in the description for the Discord that you need to join. I'll put in all the stuff in there, like Monkey Mod Manager 3 and some mods I recommend using. Now, uh, some, some, most of the legal mods are broken because Utilia is broken. If you don't know what Utilia is, it's how you use and go into modded lobbies. And you, sh I'm telling you, only use legal mods, okay? Legal mods are mods that only work in modded lobbies. If you use illegal mods, then your account can get banned. So, please only use legal mods. So, after you join Discord, you want to go down to mods. And I'm going to put on Monkey Mod Manager 3. Here's some mods you can download. This one is illegal. So you, you can get banned for this one. So like I would not recommend doing this one. Yeah, just don't do this one. Yeah. So these are legal mods. You cannot get banned. These are safe to use in modded lobbies. So this is the camera mod. And this is Bark Mod Menu. I will also maybe put Rast mod menu, but currently, because, you know, in Stump, they moved all the stuff around, I think it's Utilia is broken, but for now, you can use a, a camera mod, or when it gets fixed, you can do that, or I'll try to, I'll put a fixed one in the Discord server when it gets fixed, but yeah, so you can download those mods. Next thing you want to do, go to Google or open your browser and then just search up Oculus Software Download. And then you're going to click on this one that says download the Oculus PC app. After you do that, you're going to download that. And then you, you're going to open it. It will be called MetaQuest Link after you install it. It will take a little while to download depending on your internet speed. But then you want to open that up and log in. Then you want to go to store. And this will cost money if you don't already have the PC VR version of Gorilla Tag. But you can just search up Gorilla Tag. Click on it. And then purchase it. So, if you don't already have the PC VR version, this is going to cost you $20, but it does come with 5,000 Shine Rocks. But if you do already have it, then you can just click Install. And then once you have it installed, you're going to click on the three dots. Then Details. And then, I'm going to take this, copy it, copy the location. Then paste it in to your file explorer. Now, you are not going to have any of this weapon X stuff. You're just going to have Gorilla Tag, maybe the uh, Unity stuff, and then Gorilla Tag data. Now, what you want to do is you want to go back to the Discord, and you want to install Monkey Mod Manager 3. Right, I'm putting it in. You want to install that, and after you install it, you're going to open it up. For me, it takes a little while to load, so I'm just going to keep that open. You're going to click this, and then you're going to put it, you're going to, you're going to paste that same thing in that you had from earlier, the location of it, and then you can use that when you have that in, then You'll click open, you'll click on girltab.exe, open and then install. And then once, for me, this takes a while to load. Here's, okay, now here is how to add the mods in. So once this opens up, Monkey Mod Manager, you want to find Bepinx, Utilia, and Bepin Inject, and X Inject. And then you can do TMP Loader, and I like doing Tic-Tac-Toe. 
and then you can do install slash update and it will add the mods and it, you can download other mods from the discord server or just any mods that you find and then you want to open up this new folder that you'll see called weaponx and then you want to open plugins and then you can put in any other additional mods that you found now once you have those mods in uh you can close that out but you can go now you need to connect to your headset now now you need to install scene drive so you need to create a scene account if you don't already have one Go to store and search up Steam VR. It's completely free. Install that. Then what you want to do is you open up Steam VR. You just have that open. Then what you want to do is go grab your Oculus v or Meta VR headset, turn it on, then go to AirLink, and then on your Oculus computer app, you need to. There might be, like when you first open it up, it should say connect to your headset. Once you are connected to your headset, then you want to go on your computer, and you have Steam VR open. Just want to go to Meta, and then just click Open. And once your VR is, it's saying this for me because I'm not connected right now, but it will open up, and you should have mods. But if you are using virtual desktop like me, because you want higher quality and Airlink doesn't work. What you're going to do is you need to go to your Oculus store, purchase a virtual desktop, and then what you want to do is on your computer install virtual desktop streamer. Now this is only if you use virtual desktop. You don't have to do this. If you don't use virtual desktop, then you can just end where I said before. And then you basically what you do with virtual desktop is you would hook it up. You would type in your Oculus name on the streamer on your computer. And then on the app on your Oculus, it just should just connect. And then you can open it from there. Anyways, that is how you get mods in Girl Tech. Thank you so much for watching. If you enjoyed, then subscribe. And goodbye.